bound and arranged by the thousands. Education or adventure. What's inside their pages can nourish young minds. Something to read and escape from what's going on around you. But what 36-year-old Maurice Johnson is accused of doing with books. <laughs> took text and turned it into torment. Punishment and you could even say torture. Deputy U.S. Marshal Todd Murat says back in February, investigators were called to a school about a potential case of child abuse. The little girl went to her teacher, and the teacher then went to the school counselor. Law enforcement listened to a young girl's story of discipline that prosecutors saw as a crime because of punishment. Beat her with a belt across her back. He would punish the girl for when she did things wrong. Also, he would punish her by sexually assaulting her. I can't even imagine ever. The victim was only eight years old. I don't know what, what I would do if that happened to my daughter. Another chapter in the story of alleged abuse involved what was meant to be read. Sometimes she would have to hold books over her head, sometimes closed, sometimes not. The gravity of the situation would build. She would actually have to stand on one foot sometimes. At times, the strength of an eight-year-old gave way. And then if she put her other foot down, she would get beaten with a belt. After charges were filed, Johnson checked down. U.S. Marshals began their search for the fugitive. He needs to be held accountable for his actions. A man linked to literature in a way no author intended. Jeremy Ross, Fox 6 News.